So I've been doing a little bit of research and I stumbled upon this video by instantly showcasing their personalization feature. And the feature is so bad that I just had to make a video about it showcasing an alternative to this Instantly's AI personalization feature. Now, before I show you the alternative, let me explain why I think it's bad by showcasing the tutorial that was made by Instantly. So first, this is a one line personalization feature. And to personalize anything, first off, you of course start by uploading data and it's terrible. You need to scrape all the data yourself, as you can see here, and scrape as much data as possible to actually create a, a great first personalized line, right? So it's super manual. You have to scrape information yourself, which uh, will probably cost you money, a lot more time to do that, to generate leads. And yeah, okay, let's say if, if this is not a problem, Problem to you what caught me off guard is that this uh, instantly AI personalization feature is just AI prompts like chat GPT I'm not sure why would you even pay for it when you can do it for free I might even make a video about it and link it uh, up here but it's just chat GPT simple prompt right as you can see right here so not sure why would you go uh, out of your way to even use your own API I mean why you why pay for instantly uh, when you can do it yourself for free if you, you're already doing all of the work taking api keys scraping all the information and then using prompts that you can use in chat gpt with chat gpt yeah i just feel it's <laughs> I mean, it's so so bad that I'm making a video about it and I'll show the alternative. You'll, you'll see why I'm kind of laughing about it. So yeah, basically, I think it's terrible. So let me show you an alternative and you'll realize why I'm laughing. So for this, as you can see, you need to scrape a lot of information, right? As uh, we saw here, if you want it to work, the more information, the better, because that's how AI works, right? But what we're going to be using is Salesforce and for Salesforce, all you need is your normal normal lead list, right? You have a first name, last name, and email, and then you just add the website URL or LinkedIn or both, right? You don't even need them both. So usually you'll have this. I mean, if you don't, the email will have it. So all you need to do is copy the email and uh, split text the columns, custom, uh, add the at and that's it you have the website URL right so basically you don't need to do any scraping not like in uh, in, in instantly <laughs> um, and what you do then is when you have these leads ready right LinkedIn or website or both you just upload it to Salesforce to your contact list and then let's go create a sequence test let's say Salesforce create a sequence I'll show you how easy it is to create that personalized line so first what you can see is that we don't need no uh, API keys, right? I'm just importing the leads now. We don't need no API keys. We don't need to scrape any information. What do we do? And <laughs> look how much simpler it is. Is come here, the builder, click variables and add icebreaker. <laughs> that's, that's it where with instantly you had to scrape information then add open API op, open AI's API key then find a prompt then what else do you do it's a nine minute video we did it in <laughs> three seconds you come here you add it right that's it because you will have leads uploaded either way right I'm not counting that I mean how long does it take for you to upload leads you don't need to scrape extra information save this as CSV or just copy the link go here uh, to contacts and upload it and that's it that's the icebreaker <laughs> and it is instantly you need to <laughs> find templates AI prompts and then I I'm not sure what even happens then let's see you you need to create a column <laughs> okay oh and then uh, then you have some then you have something that's cool <laughs> okay so yeah, and this is how it works with uh, Salesforce, right? So uh, you add it, you click next. Oh no, subject line, test, next. And here's a preview. Let's see. See, it uh, personalized the email for me. So with your middest touch on TikTok, so it used the probably website data or LinkedIn data about me. Yeah, it used uh, LinkedIn data. So uh, it's great that I'm uh, doing something about TikTok, right? And uh, 
that I'm working for Salesforce and it was personalized. I didn't need to script anything. Yeah, it used LinkedIn. As you can see, this information from me that uh, head of YouTube at Salesforce, uh, that I spent a lot of time on TikTok. I got this many views, right? So it used that without me needing to script anything. What about next? What about what did it do for Frank? With caffeinated passion that could power a startup, Frank, you're mastering the turning the unpredictability of market intelligence into a symphony of precision and performance. So this was personalized for Frank. He is a heavy coffee drinker. That is for sure, as you can see here and such. So yeah, we basically we personalized everything in seconds without scraping information, without scraping their website, without scraping LinkedIn, without uh, adding AP, open API, AI's API keys, without any of that stuff. So I don't know, it's just funny to me. I had to share this uh, alternative. So of course you would have your, your email copy here, right? This is just the first, first line, the icebreaker that's personalized. And if not, uh, let's go back. You can actually personal, whoops, you can actually personalize the whole email. So this is fallback, uh, save fallback. See, you can use LinkedIn profile website or both to personalize the whole email based on your product and information about your lead from their LinkedIn and website like Salesforce, right? Or any website, right? So it, it, it's even, it's just funny that they need a nine minute video <laughs> to personalize one line when Salesforce does it in a few seconds. So I don't know, maybe it's just me, but it's hilarious. So yeah, I hope you found it useful. If you want to test out yourself, you'd see the email preview, AI preview. I'm pretty sure you get some credits on free trial so you can just see how it goes before committing. I suggest you click the link in bio and see Salesforce for yourself. <laughs> And you'll see how easy, how easy it is compared to these other software. So yeah, peace.